Hey guys, so this is Gas again. Our last time we left off, we made it to this island and we faced Shell and what's a tie and, uh, in a very tedious, stupid battle. And now we're going to take on this guy called Soul. I don't know why, if he's a gym leader or something. Actually, there probably was a sign in the beginning that we didn't look at. So let's go do that. Um, let's see. Soul Stadium, come train as your final challenge begins now. Oh, this is the final challenge? Cool. Um, if this is the final challenge, why does Professor Sigmore bother telling us that he was here? <sighs> Alright. Uh, this episode will be shorter, it'll probably be about 15, 16 minutes, uh, because the last one dragged on for half an hour, and I need to get five episodes out for this week. Unless this is going to be the last episode, then I guess not. Uh, hello, welcome to the Soul Saving Pews, you don't have enough per punches on your rank or ticket, you need four if you want to get to the Soul. I've been to four gyms, haven't I? What? Oh, is this... Uh, Makunochi, one of the strongest boxes of the gym leader. Alright, well, this is fighting types. Then I'm gonna put Ward up first. And just spam fly. I'm walking to Machi's gym, challenging and wishing the battle. Machi was defeat his best uh, prize fighter match. Are you sure you're up for it? Yeah. Good luck, trainer. Uh, hello, welcome to Machi's gym. In the red arc, and the resigning champ, undefeated, intimidating guildsman in the boxing, Muhammad, Muhammad, and the blue, 110 pounds, the young upstar champion, making chance. How, how do you know how heavy I am? Who gave you those measurements? I feel real offended. Oh my god, what the fuck? I guess it's a biker with a hunchback. <laughs> Alright, so let's hurry this up. Actually, no, 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 I shouldn't, I shouldn't, um, yeah, I'll, I'll just do it for when he switches Pokemon, so I'm um, kind of, if this is the end, which, so far, the, fr the person in the Pokemon Center said it was, we could possibly be done with this game this episode, um, there we go. And I, I sh again, if it is, I should not be rushing this. Um, I guess if this is, I'll talk about the game a little bit. Um, so basically, um, for this game, I I've had a, f a lot of fun playing when I started out. It was a nice thing to have a kind of a fresh new adventure, you know. Um, given the choices of non. Uh, regular, like, non-linear, like, uh, starter Pokemon like we usually do. Uh, like, we could have started off with, like, a Lucario or whatever. And the upside is potential, but still he has two rounds. Let's see if he can make a crowd. Wait. Really? Alright. So, I think one of my favorite things about this game was how challenging it started off. Um, I know at the time it didn't really make I know I didn't make it sound like I was having fun but the beginning of the game was actually pretty fun it's just that book one games nowadays don't really challenge you like Sun and Moon do they don't try to push you that extra mile and make you wanna like train like in the beginning of this game I didn't want to train I just wanted to go from gym to gym and just talk about whatever and have fun but the thing was I needed to sit down and I needed to actually make my team strong I needed to get ready, I needed to prepare for what was coming in the future. And I didn't want to do that. But, in the end, it was a really fun process. Even though, again, I may have not made a sound, and the water gym was a little bit of shit with the dragon type. But, that wasn't... I, I, it's not something I could have helped. And it's not something I resent the creator of this game for. Though, there were a lot of things that there has been, but... I, I, I don't know. Like, this game has its ups and... It, it definitely has more downs than ups, I would say, in my personal opinion. But it's still a pretty fun game. I, I would recommend people to play it on their own. I don't... I'll, I'll probably release episodes a little bit later of me, like, going out and collecting legendaries. It definitely won't be recorded after this, because I still need to find a list of something. Prepare, in, like, what order we're going to go catch the legendaries in. If we're only going to do, like, one legendary per episode, or maybe, like, five an episode or something like that. Um, but I am having a lot of fun. 
Uh, the, I'm really looking forward to the end because I'm hoping that like the final trainer is going to be really strong, but not strong to the point where I need to go out and like where he's going to have nothing but level 100s and I need to go out and completely retrain my team and go grind for an hour on end because there's not really a place for me to grind for experience with these high level Pokemon. It just he doesn't really pay a lot of money. I can't believe it. I've never seen Muhammad take so much uh, looking so pale. We could have found a new champion, folks. Only one more round. Go through. There shouldn't be a third round because isn't it like if you win two out of the three rounds, you automatically win? Right. Polygraph. Let's use Fly. Oh, fuck. We need to get rid of that paralysis. I'm sorry I'm hitting fast forward. It's just... I don't like the animation to fly. Uh, Menki, let's switch out to Musashi. Ord, so far, is our scapegoat when it comes to Pokemon, because he's our highest, like, level Pokemon. Um, oh, I forgot. Fucking Musashi has Aerial Ace. Damn. Oh, I keep, doing, I keep doing Now that I'm starting to press the fast forward button, it's, like, becoming a really bad habit. Like, I, I stopped the habit for a while, but then I picked it right back up again. Let's go for that Brick Break. R and we can use that. Now we'll go for the Aerial Ace. And you're dead. Uh, Chestnut. Ooh, that's... I don't like Chespin. Chestnut has a cool design, but the typing is shit. He's four times weak to flying type moves. And he just doesn't have that much of a good move pool. But when it comes to the trading card game, I love him. I'm gonna sneeze again. Damn it, I thought I was going to stop, and then I had immediately sneezed again. I don't know why. It's, it's like, I'm not sick. I don't have allergies. I've just been sneezing a lot. Alright. God, that was tedious. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, that's it. She's on top of the five has been defeated in the current gen. Uh, but the evening is just getting started, folks. Monokuchi himself is here wants to give your champion the run for their money. Their answer is money. Start when you're ready, Chance. Um, bitch, I'm going to the Pokemon Center. Uh, wait, I see a lot of people come this way to challenge Solo Makanichi. It inspires me to try myself, but then I see them losing and I get down myself again. Uh, yes, the failure of others. Uh, right now, has his name for a place where rich folks settled down. If anything, it's nice island to live on. Um... My husband and I are trying to decide on which region to visit, which what where we don't make her. Which will you go? Uh Sinnoh is beautiful and co but cold. Toe windows are large and hot. Maybe we'll go there. Uh go to Jeno. Ah, uh, we actually could go to Jeno anytime. Uh sub chance when oh yeah. He already talked to you. Uh let's look let's look at our box, since this will be probably the last time we look at it. Just wow. Like, these are the Pokemon that we've been. I'm sad we didn't get to use Zoro. We still have an egg that we need to hatch. Um, this Pikachu will never ever be touched because I hate it. And yeah. Um. I kind of knew that we weren't going to be able to use, or we weren't going to use a lot of our Pokemon. Uh, oh yeah, we can steal another Pokemon. Let's see when we can use swipe. Should I? Yep. My attempt to see really has been thwarted because my party is full. Better flee the scene of the potential crime. I don't understand what the point of just stealing Pokemon is. Um, so let's drop off Chomper. And let's go steal, swipe that Pokemon. It's probably going to be another Dark type. Um, I mean, Shao. No. Why are they all trash? I am kind of postponing 
I don't know why. I do want this to be over, but at the same time, I don't want this episode to be over. I don't, I don't know. I, I, I was actually expecting to sit down, because since each episode is 20 minutes or so, uh, I was expecting to be playing this for at least two hours, and it's been maybe less... It's been a little bit le less, or maybe just about an hour. And not all happens are sitting down train as we spend our days fighting the best gossip. I heard kids been taken on gym leader after gym leader. I hope they come to our island soon. Do you see the Saiyan man in the next po- One second. Uh, uh, sexy Pokemon Center. Here he was a fo- second. Please, the only sexy Pokemon professor is Kukui. I did see me get him a bug catcher. I made it here. That's my- That means anyone could do it if they try. I guess. Uh, Rain Island got its name because of the shape like a crown. Crown, not still like home. My hubby bought me a super rod for my birthday, so I'm having trouble using it. I'm trying to teach my wife how to fish. I think it's, she's doing well. Oh yeah, we didn't even get berries to this region. Um, let's, uh, I don't know what the point of this is. Um, let's see. I traveled to the Isles for Rain Crow. What do I do now? Maybe I'll go and visit the Trainer Isle. No! There's no more. This game's over. <laughs> Shut up. There's nothing more. Um, are you familiar with the fairy type? They've only just been recently discovered. You mean you never knew? Oh, I'm supposed to take you here then. Uh, because Moon Blast and Attack them might cut your opponent's special attack strong, strong, doesn't it? It sounds strong, but I, I've never personally used it. Oh yeah, this we already talked to these girls. Um, we didn't talk to this guy. Uh, you look very well traveled. Have you come far? Glenwood Town. That's pretty far. You should head back there sometime. Did you see that weird weather we're having? I've never seen it snow on the island before. Nope, because I've already cleared it up. Um. Uh, my Umbreon likes licking the defrosting on my donuts. My trainer gave me a nibble of sugar donut and I raised my special attack bit. Cool. Um, that's all we could talk to, so... Let's actually put Musashi in front. Why is Machamp shiny green? I hate it. Uh, that was a pretty good battle, kid. My name is Musashi and I... Ba and I used to be a nobody who got beat up and I trained hard and now I have my own gym. They say I'm the toughest in rank card. Don't believe me? Then let's fight. Like, I love Machamp. Machamp is probably one of my favorite fighting types. Because he got that booty. But... but like, he's a very strong Pokemon. And... Like, when it comes to fighting types, he's really the only one that screams, I'm a fighter, other than maybe... Hitmon Lee, Hitmon Chan, or Primate. Yeah, I like, like Conkledur, it makes me feel like he'd be a ground type, you know? Like, maybe he's just a really strong ground type Pokemon who uses those pillars or something that he pulls out of the ground himself. Everyone has leftovers. Why wouldn't you have leftovers? Let's all have leftovers. Everybody gets a leftover. I wish there was just an option to speed up the animations. Um, Infernape. We're just gonna go through just Musashi if we can. Why the hell not? I know it might sound stupid that I'm using nothing but. Uh, ooh. Oh, that hurt. That hurt pretty bad. Oh, um, actually, I, I don't think I'm gonna keep Musashi. Oh, Musashi's so close to level 90 though. Let's switch out to Chomper. He hasn't really been getting a lot of love. He's still level 85 for when we brought him to the second Elite Four, so... Let's use Scald. Let's go for the burn. Let's go for the burn! Okay, nope. I fucking hate you. I'm critical! Yeah, sorry for speeding that up. Champ! My champ. Um, let's go in with Ord. Um, 
You might be on my champ, but I am the champ. Ew. Ew! That green is so ugly. He literally just looks like a piece of shit. Like, he is a legit turd. Or a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. A Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. Turtle. I wish the Pokeballs that we were stealing were actually like... I was gonna... Can I use Earthquake on him? No. Yeah. I wish that, like, um... The Pokemon that we stole from the gym leaders were actually the Shinies. So I like Shiny. That would've been cool if that glass... Wait, that's not even a fighting type! What? Hey, there's Greninja! What the hell's wrong with you people? That would've been nice if that had a, like... It wouldn't have been nice because it'd probably be really fucking annoying. But it'd be cool if, uh... That Gliscor had Poison Heal and a Toxic Orb on him. I love that setup. It probably would've been hard to deal with, but... Anyway. It also would've been nice if this Greninja had Protein and he used a fighting type move. And can't believe it, here's your Rancor ticket. And he's down. I know I can still get a challenge for people here take this as a gift. TM31, cool. Unlike Tease Brick Breaks, amazing boxing moves. Hey, it's okay. Now that you have four punches, it means you can take on the champion, so uh what's about uh, I was gonna keep this a short episode, but I don't feel like I don't I think that just to the champion alone will be very, like, I don't think it would take a lot of time. And it's definitely not good enough for its own episode. So this might actually be the final episode. 12, 13, er, so 20, 30, 40. 40 of those. And... I wish we had elixirs or something, or maybe lepa berries. Really, all we need is four restores for this game. Alright, peace out, Girl Scout. So now we're going to take on the boss, the challenger, the the man himself, Soul. Uh, hello, for the Soul State. Unfortunately, wait, I recognize you now. You must be Chance. Soul told me that you moved to the top of the list if you come to challenge him. Would you like to battle Soul now? Yeah. Good luck. Alright, here we go. Exactly my words. He has an Empoleon statue, so I'm guessing that's what he's going to be using. Hello, and welcome to Soul Stadium. Now entering the stage is the first time challenger, the Soul. Chance, Chance has already gained his fame as a champion of both Tunada and Jota, but will he be able to unset the soul of unseat soul as well? We'll just have to wait and see. Speaking of soul, oh my god, he's such a fucking edge lord. Soul enters the stage with the impressive pre uh, pedigree of wins under his belt. Soul became the champion of the Sinnoh region with his partner Empoleon. How will we fare against Chance? Stay frosty, folks. This match is about to begin. Risking its shiny Empoleon. Huh, so you came at last. I came to Rancor with a desire to find strong trainers such as myself. A few have come close, but eh. Anyway, enough chat. Time to battle. This is... I hope it's kind of intense. Yeah, that's shiny Empoleon, though. Right, got the hair cross out first. Level 90s. Alright. So, we're not too underleveled. Um, I don't expect us to win this first try. But it'd be really cool if we did. I'm not gonna fast forward because this is the final fight, man. Alright. So Musashi. Right. Houndoom? No! Oh, it's a dark type, so we might as well, so we can at least use Burk Break. I was hoping to switch out oh wait, are we sick still? No? Alright. I was hoping to switch out to Chomper. But I pressed X. Alright, Houndoom is also done for the count. Sableye. Oh, 
You can use Chomper for this. And Sable Eye has no weaknesses at this. Well, a fairy, but we don't have any fairy type moves. Let's hit it with that Scald and probably get the burn. Come on. Uh, nope. Oh, please don't tell me this is going to be like a prankster recover Sableye because I hate that so much. Uh, what's going for Surf? Seismic Toss. I've never seen a freaking Sableye use that. Probably because most people don't even run a physical Sableye. Um, usually when I run Sableye, it's Protect, Recover, Will-O-Wisp, and then, uh, Sucker Punch. I think that was his fourth mood. I haven't used my Sableye in forever. Burn? Ah, oh, damn it. No, not the Sea Incense! That looked like a bag of freaking whipped cream. <laughs> we just hit 20 minutes, but it's alright. For a store, I'm okay with that. Well, that means we get a free shot, and with with Skull, just means we have a chance for burn. Yes, we got the burn off. And of course, he's gonna have leftovers, like a good stable. I should have. There's a fly flying around my face, and it's kind of hard to not swat at it and make a lot of noise while doing so. Who are you going for? Roserade. So this game has some sort of... <laughs> no, not... So this game still has like some sort of AI system, I'm guessing. Um... Roserade... I want to go for the Shocker, because he has a nice time move. The Ord seems like the most likely... Or the best candidate to do so. Since he has both Earthquake and Fly. So, at least its attack got down, which I don't think it matters because Roserade is a special attacker. Could, could you not say my ward was seated? <laughs> Alright, let's use Fly. Sludge Bomb. Ooh, that would've hurt. Oh shit, I don't think that was gonna knock it out. Oh, but it did! Holy shit. Another Gliscor? Um, I'll go for Wukong. I'm pretty sure that Gliscor is flying and ground, but for some reason it's considered a poison type. Um, let's use Mach Punch. Yeah, that's not gonna do much. Come on, live. Live! You've gotta live! Holy shit, how did he live? <laughs> Alright, Wukong, you gotta- I I'm sorry, but you can't stay. Um, I feel like Chomper might be the best choice for this, since he, again, he's a ground type. He's gonna go out for the Earthquake- or no, Rock Slide. Well, at least he's got that in- uh, not individuality, but- at least he's not just using the same moves over and over again. No, I can't. I, I can't do the same. I can't say the same thing for myself, but whatever. Um, come on. Yeah, there we go. Now, Glasgow is a really bulky like Pokemon, so I was not expecting that to one hit KO. Especially since I've tra uh, trained and raised one myself. They they're pretty great. Probably gonna go for the. I don't think he actually hit the area where he's gonna be able to use before restore. Yeah. So next turn he should be down for the count. Though again, we could be taken out pretty easily. If he gets a crit, he is faster than uh, Chomper. But hopefully that doesn't. Ah, oh, she's going for the poison. No. No. Shit. Um, come on, Scott. And we got it. I'm 
so that means we'll four Pokemon, right? Sableye will keep chompering because this was his fight in the beginning. So he's only got two Pokemon left, and that's Sableye and it's Empoleon. For Empoleon, we are going to use the Shocker. Good thing he's still got the burn, and he's not going to use Full Restore just yet. And we are faster than him, so of course, Tableye is. Tableye. Sableye is. What? He didn't. Oh no, he's going to. Ah, he's going to get burned, so. But the burn's probably not gonna kill him since he has leftovers. Well, let's let's pray and hope. Oh god, just enough. Alright. Holy on. Right. He's gonna use his ace, so we're gonna use ours. I really do think Shopper sh shock the shocker is our kind of like MVP or something, because he's been in both playthroughs of Pokemon so far, and he just means a lot. Hopefully that's not enough. Uh, it seems like he might be holding a Mystic Water or something, but it doesn't matter because Napoleon is going down next turn. Well, he's holding leftovers. This the creator of this game could have made their like this guy a lot harder if he gave the Gliscor Poison Heal with a Toxic Orb and Polion. Oh shit! Shit! Wait, what? Are you stupid? Well, apparently, just I don't understand why he did that, but whatever, it worked. Well, at least at least Spectre gets to get on this fight. But for Polion, he could have given a Mystic Water. For Glyscore, he could have given a Poison Heal, Toxic Orb. Um, Sableye, he... Sableye was fine. There was nothing wrong with that. It's sad I don't really remember any... Uh, Roserade, um... Maybe a Miracle Seed. Or, I don't know, maybe, maybe he could have used, like, a Roselia with an Evoli. I don't know. I don't even know if that's a viable setup. So this... The next Thunderbolt might just be enough to take him down. Come on. We did it. I think we just beat Glazed. Guys, it's over, isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it over? Uh, so the R-Scale Train is a ranker after all. I'm not going to any other regions. I'm done. <laughs> the winner is... Chance, yes. They continue to insist with the same uh, showy stuff, but you've got talent. You put time and effort into raising your team, and it's gotten you this far. You've won title of the Rancor champion, champion of three regions. That must be the first. Thanks for letting me hone my skills against you. Our next battle won't be the same as this one, but be ready. Watch the credits. Yeah. Now watching the credits will gain your trainer star, but if you are unable to save, you'll lose all date. Uh, you. Are unable to save, you'll lose all your data as you still wish to watch the credits. No, so. I guess we beat the game? Um, is there something in the PC we could check? Chances PC? No. Uh, so, we just beat Pokemon Glaze. Um, I'm actually going to go... So the game does understand that I beat him, so I, I don't know. Um, I kind of do want to go through the credits, but at the same time, I don't know. Uh, if it's going to make it so I can't save, which I couldn't save anyway, so I don't know why I was concerned about that. So let's just go back to Chaco Town. Oh, well, we didn't start off at Chaco Town. Let's just go back home. Um, 
But yeah, this was Pokemon Glazed. I, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it seems like we weren't having fun with our ups and downs, but in the end, I, we still made it through the game. Well, I, I'm going to try to avoid Pokemon games like this for now, but, for, well, from now on, but hopefully it doesn't come down to that. Um, this is our house, hope her parents aren't here. Um, maybe go talk to the professor? Ah, uh, Chance, are you curious about how your book is coming up? Um... So I don't know if there's someone we can talk to or something. Like, the game did tell us to come back to our hometown, but there's nobody here? But yeah, that was Pokemon Glazed. And we're gonna end off right here in our hometown of Glenwood. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this series. If you did, leave a like down below, comment down below what your favorite part of the series has been, and what what do you want to see in the future? Um, after this series, I have one or two ideas of what we're gonna do next. Um, there's that race that we plan on doing, or uh, maybe I'll focus on streaming for a little bit more, since now I don't have to worry about this. I don't know. Maybe my next series is technically going to be The Last of Us. Uh, if you want to watch the streams, they're always archived on the channel. Sorry, I yawned. It, it's, it's kind of like occasion right now, but... Um, I usually stream late at night, because that's when my internet is at its peak. It's I can only stream under certain conditions, you know. Um, I try to stream 60 FPS, 720p if I can. If I can't, then I usually just go for 720p standard. And the chat will always be displayed, so you're not always left out when I'm talking to people. The only times I don't display chat are when I'm playing stuff like the Final Fantasy 15 demo or stuff like that, where I need to actually see the full screen and enjoy the whole thing. But, again, I hope you guys enjoyed the series. And I hope that the more series I do, the more professional I get at this. I'm not expecting this to turn into a job or a career or anything. I'm just having fun with what I can. And I hope you guys are going to enjoy this ride with me. And, I don't know, share this with your friends. I don't know. So, I hope you all have a great day. I hope you all have a wonderful time with the series. I know it wasn't the best. I know it wasn't the most high quality, but it, it was something. Um, so, yeah. I'll prob- I, I don't know if I'm still gonna go and catch all the legendaries since there's six regions of legendaries to go out and capture. And we've only got like maybe six or seven captured down so far and there's like 20 something. But if you would like to see- go, uh, if you'd like to see me go out and capture all the legendaries in like another little bonus episode or something, leave a comment down below saying so- or leave- or hit that like button, you know. So again, I hope you all have a great and wonderful time. I hope you all have a great and wonderful day. And until the next series. Bye bye.